These next problems are about circles and the kinds of measurements we use with circles. Here's a circle, not a perfect one, but my attempt at it. And the first measurement you should know is the distance across the circle at the widest point, right through the middle. And that is called the diameter. And another measure that relates to that is called the radius. And that is the distance from the center of the circle out to one edge along that um, diameter. Actually, a radius could be anywhere from the center. That could be a radius. That could be a radius. That's a radius there. All of those are radii, as they say. And a radius is exactly half the length of the diameter. So the diameter is all the way across. A radius is half the way across. And then the other thing you need to know is how the word for the distance around the outside of the circle. That is called the circumference. So if this was a track, how far it would be starting from one point and getting back to where you started by walking around it. So diameter, radius, and circumference. Let's look at some problems. This one says, what word names the distance around the circle? And that is circumference. The next one says, if the radius of a circle is three inches, what is its diameter? So just to remind you again, the diameter is all the way across. The radius is just half that distance. So if this radius is three, well, the other radius on the other side is also going to be three. So the diameter is going to be three plus three, or two times the, the radius. So the diameter will be six. This next one says, if the diameter of the circle is 14 inches, what is the radius? Well, that's kind of the opposite of what we just did. The whole length is 14. A radius is half of that, so that would be 7, so 7 inches. And one more. This one, a little trickier, it says three balls are placed side by side as shown below. The diameter of one ball is 4 fifths of an inch. How long is the row of balls? And actually, they show them here with a little bit of space in between, but I don't think they meant to do that. I think they're all snugged up right next to each other. So what we really need to do is add this diameter to this diameter to this diameter. The diameters are all four-fifths of an inch. So really, this problem is four-fifths plus four-fifths plus four-fifths. And when we're adding fractions, we need to first make sure that the denominator, the number on the bottom, that the denominators are all the same. They are. So when that's the case, you can add across the top 4 plus 4 plus 4. That's 12 fifths. And maybe that's the answer um, they want you to, to uh, choose. Or maybe they've um, turned this into a mixed number. How many fives could I take out of 12? I could take out 2, and that would leave 2 left over. So it would be 2 and 2 fifths inches. So that's a little bit about the measures of a circle.